uh, Deepak Chopra. Chopra? You guys Chopra. know him? Yeah. Chopra? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Author of 95 books and one of the world's most uh, famous well-being experts. He told the Wall Street Journal that you can't be too busy to meditate. Huh. So what's the one thing in your life you're never too busy to do? Is there something you guys have? Well, I don't have kids, so for me, I can do whatever the heck I want. <laughs> uh, but in terms of you're never too busy to meditate, I believe you, I just don't want to. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. But, like, <laughs> Great, but good for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sounds awesome. I'll take your word I'll for it, I'll take your Deepak. word. I believe you. Yeah. I believe I you. I mean, I'll defend the idea of never too busy to meditate. I have forgotten to. Meditation is hard. It is hard, and I think it's everyone who is a meditator feels that they're doing it wrong and they're bad at it. And the thing is, that might be comforting for people to know is that everyone feels that way. Is that our, our, it's like herding cats. Your mind is this jumping, you know, monkey mind going over all these trees, and, and it's very annoying. So you have to keep on herding it back and and settling it down. And the reason why it is so important is I think that is you if you when you make a habit of it, you become a kinder, gentler, more calm person. You're more in control. That explains everything, of your Kyle. <laughs> yeah. no, I'm just kidding. You might <laughs> find it helps. I'm just, I'm just saying, that, you know, I, there are some things. Although I am not a perfect meditator, I will say the one thing that I have made as a non negotiable is journaling. I do it ever since, mm. like from a year ago, every morning I do it f without fail um, for at least like five minutes. And I just feel like it's a, just a dump. It's like a. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a way That's to. That's what dump. I do every day. Yeah. Here's your non negotiable. <laughs> no one's going to get in the way of mine. <laughs> This sounds so boring and so cliche, but if anybody knows me, they know my non-negotiable is exercise. Mm -hmm. And I truly believe in the saying that if you do not make time for exercise, then at some point in your life, you're going to have to make time for illness. Ooh. And so to me, exercise is the antidote to pretty much anything, whether yeah. it's physical health and or mental health and yeah. everything in between. When's too, your book coming out? That's when's my book yeah. coming out? Yeah. Yeah. Enough books about that. Yeah. I think too many people depend on me too many, I depend on me. And so if I am not exercising, everything and everyone around me is going to suffer. So yep. that's my non-negotiable. Mm -hmm. I completely Every agree with that. Yeah. Do you have a non-negotiable? Yeah. I do, but besides what I mentioned earlier, it actually <laughs> coincides with uh, the morning BM. Uh, it is <laughs> non-negotiable uh, word games. Generally, the New York Times uh, word games. Oh, yeah. I don't think, I have skipped Wordle once in like three years. But uh, yeah, the, the crossword spelling bee, Octordal, quartal, I do them all. I break them up throughout the day, but they're non-negotiables at certain times Why of the day. Why is this? Uh, calms me, I'm really good at them. <laughs> <laughs> it's your meditation. It, it, it is my meditation in many ways. In yeah, and it becomes habitual. Yeah. I uh, love them. That's why you're so smart. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay, I get it. I think I need to add that to the list. <laughs> yeah. While you're working out. <laughs> it's in my ass. Hey, you, come a bit closer. We've got so many more must-see interviews, spicy debates, lifestyle tips, and pop culture moments. So subscribe to our channel by tapping the logo below and don't miss out.